Now, some people controversially say these days, can you wear uh, trainers with, shoe, uh, with suits? Now, on the screen now, you can see one of the most iconic images of all time, which is the, the famous Abbey Road one, which has been mimicked by everyone. And on the front is John in a pair of white plimsolls. And I'm assuming they're plimsolls, but I think you know a bit more about that, don't you? Yeah, so he's wearing a brand called Spring Courts, which is still about today. Um, I think they're a French brand. If I don't, I might be wrong, but I think I'm pretty sure they're a French brand. But I think there's something very European in them wearing a pair of trainers with a suit. And I think it depends on what suit you're wearing and what pair of trainers you're wearing. And I think it's more the kind of, in my mind anyway, the more of the plimsoll kind of pump style trainer goes better than, I don't know, you wouldn't wear like a, a bowling shoe or a bowling kind of trainer or. No, you wouldn't wear a high pedal. top, would you? You're not like That's some right. of the high tops, yeah. you're some of those really big ones. But you see quite a few of like the Italian and Spanish football managers. They seem to pull that look off. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. It, it's definitely a thing. Like you, I think to make it look good, you need to make it look almost what people would term like a kind of retro rather than modern. But when you put a pair of like kind of modern looking trainers with it, you do look a bit. You're on your way to court and you forgot to go and buy your <laughs> pair of something like that. <laughs> you're on your way to court.